store the rear paper tray there is a size adjuster we have to move it on the one side now we install the A4 size sheets here open the front paper output tray ink cartridge chamber is just behind this door so just open it and these are the ink cartridges which is 67 black and 67 tricolor so we install one by one so install the ink cartridge push it inwards hold the printer with the other hand and if you slide it a little bit it will lock itself and now close the ink cartridge chamber door now printer will print alignment page so this is the printer alignment page and we need to open the top scanner bed and place it facing downwards like this on the left hand side close the lid and press the copy button once now it will do the ink cartridge alignment for the best print quality to do a copy we can open the top scanner lid and place a page facing downwards this side and click on the copy button and it will send a command for the printer to do the copy this printer has a top feeder tray as well and we can use it for the copy I'll show you how to do that so take the page and put it like this so that it can go here and click on the copy button and wait for the printer to take it and copy it so feeder tray is just taking the sheet and then it will start to copy so that's the way we can use this printer uh, for the initial setup and we can also do the copy test as you can see here wi-fi direct setup wi-fi direct setup is actually inbuilt wi-fi system of this printer so we are looking for this icon which is a wi-fi direct icon the smaller one as i can show you here so this is the one and if you don't see it then we need to activate for that we need to press the Wi-Fi uh, icon once it will switch off the blue light and switch on the Wi-Fi direct only Wi-Fi direct will show up here we also need to print the printer's Wi-Fi password for that we need to press the information button once and wait for the printer to print a page printer information page and this includes the name of the Wi-Fi direct printer and the password so if you check under the Wi-Fi direct icon the details are available here now take your iPhone or Android phone and download the HP smart app from the App Store also open the setting and then open the Wi-Fi in the Wi-Fi setting we look for the printer's name that is HP DexJet 4100 series printer as we can see here that is the one so once we click it it will ask the password now enter that password here so once we enter the password we click on the join button you will see it is connected and it also says there is no internet because it's a Wi-Fi from the printer now open the HP smart app we have to add this printer here so click on the plus button on the top you will see this printer here 410 series on the next screen also it displays the IP address of this printer which is for the Wi-Fi direct only and click on this printer here now I'll show you how to do the scanning wireless scanning so open the top scanner and place a page we want to scan facing downwards close the lid now go to the app and open the app and click on the printer scan you will see this screen here click on the blue icon and wait for the printer to scan and transfer the image here so here is the final image if you want you can save it or you can share it with the email thanks for watching thanks for watching